She's like, somebody's talking about me being stressed. I'm going to call him and fuss about something. Hello, happy people. So today we are at my sister's house because I'm currently babysitting, but my niece and my nephew are in the house happy watching their YouTube videos. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> So, um, I think my nephew's window is like up there too, so I don't know if you, he could see me or hear me or whatever. But yeah, I did some video too showing what my sister's house looks like. It's very nice and calm and serene and honestly, it's just good for doing a video. So I decided to do a video here because look at this lovely background. Oh, I can't see now because of the glare. Hopefully you can see though. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to do a video because I already did one on the joys of renovation. And no, the joys of the Renaissance Festival. And I have that one in process right now. The only thing that's been taking really long is, it's a combination of things, but the, the biggest thing is one, I took like 500 pictures at the Renaissance Festival. And it's just a daunting task to try to figure out which one I want to actually utilize in the, uh, the video, which ones I should say, cause it's gonna be a lot that I'm gonna be using in there because I wanted to incorporate photography more into my YouTube videos because I do love photography. I think I've mentioned that before in a couple of my videos, but yeah, photography is great for me. So I wanted to find a way to actually incorporate it into doing a YouTube video. So since I went to Renaissance Festival and had video and tons of pictures, I decided to make that video it. Unfortunately, between work and the elections and just like the last two weeks have been crazy and hectic, I just have been taking forever to do it. So I want to make a video just to let you know why I've been taking forever in case you're wondering like, is he still even doing it? And I just want everybody to know in case you're wondering, yes, I'm still around, I'm still doing things. I just gave myself like a little mental health moment just because again, there was a lot going on in the world between uh, still, even with the elections right now, there's still so much with the elections going on and just like the results and people, <sighs> The president's talking about he doesn't want the results or he doesn't believe in the results and I didn't vote for him so he'll have to get over it. People that voted for him will have to get over it. He had his chance. He had his four years and I didn't want to like sway anybody with the voting process even though I definitely did not want people to vote for Trump but to each their own. So that's why I didn't make a big thing of it or even try to tell people who I voted for because I want them to feel like I was trying to pressure them or saying this person's right, that person's right. Go with who you want to because at the end of the day, politicians are all shady and they, none of them keep all the promises that they promise to keep. So, you know, we're, uh, the person I voted for, I felt was the least worst <laughs> of the choices that were optional, but it's still not everything I wanted. He still doesn't represent everything I wanted, but I'm happy overall with what's going on right now. But yeah, so in case you were wondering, I'm still alive, I'm still around. I might not even like edit this video or anything because it's only like three minutes at this point and I only plan to do like five minutes or so. Just again, talking, <laughs> saying hi, seeing what's up and just letting you guys know what's been up with me. Um, that's also gonna be like a quick side thing of what I'm gonna make this video, the joys of just giving yourself a mental health day and just like relaxing sometimes because again, it's been two weeks since I last filmed at this point. Really, time-wise, it's been almost three weeks, but thankfully YouTube is not quick to adjust the time all the time. So it looks like two weeks. It's probably been two and a half weeks or something like that, but yeah, I was just giving myself some time to just relax. The first three four days because I was on that consistent schedule was a little bit weird for me I felt very like oh no I should be doing something right now I've been so consistent with it I should make sure I get this video done in time but it just really stressed me out then like when I the, the next day after I decided that I really need to do it because it was so important the whole day I was just like oh. and like I started editing pictures but I was like I'm not editing these pictures quick enough I'll never finish them in time to do the video I still don't even know which pictures I want to use for the video and it just became too much to like have to deal with so I just decided you know what no calm down I'm not gonna do all of this right now I'm going to wait and let it become two weeks before I actually post the pic post the video because again sometimes you just have to in life put a whole lot less pressure on yourself and there are so many instances in life where you put so much pressure on yourself and you down yourself so much life isn't about that life isn't worth all of that like life is for living and enjoying so Anytime you can enjoy your life, do enjoy your life. Anytime you can not stress about stuff, don't stress about stuff. So just know that everything in its time will happen how it needs to happen. So especially with YouTube where things are so easy to get things on your time and just kind of 
YouTubers pop up and with videos randomly, you never know how. I know there are always YouTubes, especially ones that I'm watching right now that have been super, super, super consistent with their videos. Like, some YouTubers have been putting out videos almost daily, some like every two days, which is amazing, but between my job and other things, like, I can't do that easily. These are people that are, YouTube is their job, so they have the the resource and all that to do all of that but not this guy <laughs> I still have many bills to pay I'm still not big Willie Stalin so yeah I have to like make them when I can with the time I have and also I'm not anywhere near like a state of making money off of YouTube I'm literally just doing it for the fun of it so if I'm doing it for the fun of it stressing myself out about not doing it in time just isn't the answer <laughs> that's never the answer even with like work if you want a promotion really bad and you get passed for a promotion for whatever stupid reason don't put pressure on yourself to say oh well I didn't get the promotion so now I'm gonna have to quit this job for sure because like I deserve that promotion it's not right which may very well be true but sometimes you just gotta kind of stick it out see what happens but also even if you do decide that leaving is best for you you just gotta not put pressure on yourself to like do it quickly like we all have jobs that we have or have had that we feel like it's just like uh, dragging our feet to go in but it's money and like if you don't put too much stress on yourself with jobs in general like for me personally I'm a server at a restaurant and I've been serving for like 12 years now and the money is really good because people like my personality because I have lots of personality I'm very chipper <laughs> as evident by these videos but it still can be a very very thankless and daunting job especially right now with corona like there's still so many people that come into the restaurants like oh why do I have to wear my mask this isn't right this is so uncomfortable like this says that it doesn't even work like ma'am ma'am sir sir what does the sign say I don't care what you feel I don't care what you think like these are the rules that imparted to me and imagine being me having to wear a mask for 8 to 12 hour shifts and you only have to wear a mask from the time you walk into the door to the time you set the table which I personally don't even think is like that effective myself like if we're gonna have people wear a mask in a restaurant have them wear the mask the whole time because otherwise it's just not really that safe or practical but yeah people have their entitlement and they get like really finicky about the the most annoying things in the restaurant but for me personally at the end of the day it's like it's the end of the day when I'm walking out of the door from my job I'm leaving all of that behind like if I was mad if I was stressed it's all gone but for me personally too like uh, a good way to help me get through the time and get through the stress is I just sing songs to myself like songs that I like I'm just constantly singing it especially when I get a bop stuck in my head I'm just bopping around with that bop all day <laughs> without even worrying about like what's going on around me so that's what I usually recommend for people who are like stressing out and also just joking like I'm always joking and clowning on the guests that are just like again the ones with the mask the ones that are complaining because like I tell them the bar is first come first serve and then somebody beats them to the seat and they're like hey I was here for three three hours waiting for that bar so you're like yeah man but I said first come first serve and it's not my job to police that bar like you know what the deal is so don't act brand new <laughs> but again to each their own people have their own issues people get mad about what they get mad about but that's not me I'm not stressing about stuff like that so yeah that's why in case you were wondering I haven't done a video in a while because to make this video into more of a uh, idea video this video is the joys of mental health t days <laughs> yeah the, the joy of not stressing out one of those but that's basically my reasoning for not having a video out for a couple of weeks but I'm sure for most of you you probably didn't even notice because a you're probably just finding my channel this could be years in the future where you're just like oh you have so many subscribers now and you you've been so consistent now that's a good job for future me but past me hasn't been doing anything the last couple of weeks because I just wanted to relax and just kind of enjoy well I can't say really enjoy because I've also been working a lot this week because between like uh, the life the money thing situation the unemployment situation happening like I've been working a lot a lot of hours more so than I have even before the the pandemic just so because I'm, I'm trying to be consistent with, like saving money and keeping money in my account as opposed to beforehand when like my account was consistently on the red so yeah I'm working a lot but I'm still having fun along the way still keeping myself very low on the pressure scale because I do not my, my father passed away from having a stroke and like and my mom sometimes as a especially as a doctor she gets very nervous and rattled about things and what I've learned from the two of them is don't be like that <laughs> like I love them they are great people but they they definitely have their their stressed out moments where they really let life 
get to them. And that's one of the things where it's like, that's something I definitely don't want to emulate from my parents. So thankfully, because of that, I have, I think that is a big part of why I'm so like calm and like happy and low on the stress in life in general. It's just because I know from seeing how it can affect my parents. Speak of the mom, the, the phone just interrupted or the video just stopped because my mom called me and she was stressed out about something <laughs> as usual. Like she knew in the air, she's like, somebody's talking about me being stressed. I'm gonna call him and fuss about something. But yeah, thus is life. But again, this is why I try my best to just be very like, <sighs> do yoga, do some meditation, stretch, and just keep the cool. <laughs> But anyway, I feel like that's that's most of like what I want to say in this video. I will likely show this video. I'm not even sure if I will. I, I've been going back and forth because I'm, I'm thinking I want to do the Renaissance one first because that's the one chronologically that I filmed first. But I'm, you know, I, I, I'm still working on it right now because again, there's so many pictures to kind of decide on what I want to put in there and kind of mention it. And also I am kind of working on trying to like up my production things because I, I, I mentioned before in the videos but I'm the one who edits everything I put it, all of that together myself so I've been learning and watching other videos and stuff on how to edit and whatnot because while I do know the picture editing process I hadn't learned video editing since now when I started to do YouTube so it's been a really fun fun process because I do enjoy that with editing especially when you edit your own YouTube videos you really get to show your voice and your style and everything but yeah, I think I'm still going to likely use this one. I'm likely going to just show it first anyway, just because I want to take my time with the other video and I do want to, again, kind of step my game up because I was proud of the Halloween video I did too, mostly because of the, um, the uh, what do you call it? My little graphic, my little smiley face graphic. I made a special one just for Halloween. And then after that, I realized, oh, that could be something I could do now too. Like I can have the smiley face change based on what the video is about, depending on if it's something I can change for. Like for the Renaissance Festival, that one's a Renaissance theme. So I'm trying to figure out some way to make the smiley face like Renaissance-y looking and whatnot. So that's kind of just like one little inside info into like what I'm doing and why it's taking long. but. Hopefully you'll see that video in a few days, but this one you'll likely see very soon because I'm filming this on a, what is today? Today's a Monday, so I'll probably have it up by like Tuesday, Wednesday, honestly, because I'm not sure if I'll edit it. If anything, I'll just cut out like pauses and stuff that I have in the video. So you'll likely see all of this video in its entirety. I don't know how much editing I'll do for it, but yeah. In case you're wondering if I'm still doing YouTube, if I'm still around, I'm still here, I'm still around. I just gave myself some time because I did put out like six, seven videos consistently. So I do feel like I did a good job with that and I earned a little uh, two week vacation from like making sure I crank out everything, but still have lots of things that I want to do videos on, still have lots of subjects that I want to do videos on too. But yeah, I just wanted to take my time and just kind of like learn and kind of up my production value as I go along and learn things. So yeah, that's what I've been up to. I hope you've all been keeping your stress levels down too, because again, remember stress is a killer. Stress can hurt your body and affect you and it's not worth it. Stressing about any this, that, it's really not worth it. So just keep yourself calm, keep yourself cool enjoy your life and love each other yeah <laughs> so I'll see you in the next video happy people uh, who knows what the video will be maybe it'll be the Renaissance video maybe it'll be a whole nother video maybe you'll never see this video but yeah if you do I'll have a little note in the side here that says you see this video right there because I usually give myself space for the words and stuff <laughs> But yeah, <laughs> I usually don't know how to end these videos off because it's just always like, what should I do? What should I say? I feel like this is good though. So bye, happy people.